The Israeli military has warned people to evacuate communities in southern Lebanon, signaling that it may widen a ground operation launched earlier this week against Hezbollah. That announcement comes as a series of massive blasts were heard in the capital Beirut in the early hours of Friday morning. Israeli forces said they'd struck around 200 Hezbollah targets, with the IDF promising severe damage against Hezbollah will continue. At least nine Israeli soldiers have been killed in clashes with Hezbollah in southern Lebanon, where Israel announced the start of what it says is a limited ground incursion. Meanwhile, the World Health Organization says its staff are working in dire circumstances, with three dozen health facilities in Lebanon closed. In Lebanon alone, 28 health workers have been killed in the last 24 hours. Many health workers are not reporting to duty as they fled the areas where they work due to bombardments. This is severely limiting the provision of mass trauma management and continuity of health services. Israel says it's targeting Hezbollah after nearly a year of rocket attacks that began on October the 8th and displaced around 60,000 Israelis from communities in the north. Israel has carried out retaliatory strikes over the past year that have displaced tens of thousands on the Lebanese side.